Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. I'm here with my junk wife, Laura. I'm here with my robot husband, Nathan. And we're here to look at the new Hexbug junk bots. Ooh, so this is the uh, one pack or one bot pack. Uh, there's also a larger pack as well as I think or some sort of play set, uh, I believe, we, as well. We tried to get the bigger one, but by the time we went to go order it, it was sold out or not in stock or whatever it all happened. So. Yeah, so uh, they come in like a little rubbish bin kind of container that has a chain with a padlock locking it. It's a pretty cool look. So, it is very cool. I like it. Uh, so we're going to unlock, search, and then build some sort of bot. So yeah, unlock the chain, search through the trash, discover and build your bot. Uh, this is series one. Uh, this says discover all 36 junk bots. I wonder if that's over series one or something, or if they're all out in this one set. I don't know. Uh, ages three plus. It says also pieces. 15 plus oh, no. pieces. Not things to put together. So I guess it depends on maybe which character oh, you get. That's almost like a rubbery sort of... Oh, I didn't realise it was going to be rubbery. <laughs> so there's a lock. Yeah, the lock just sort of pops off. Okay. Kind of the scissors and I'll take you the may. plastic off this one. Thank you. I might just sort of angle the camera up a bit so we can get a better shot. All right, I'm about to pop it out. Oh, oh boy. Oh my, okay. I need, I need to dig through the trash. in here. <laughs> Galacticos. Right. Crunchy Clump cereal. So we've got lots of accessories with your... Toilet paper. <laughs> character, okay. Garbage bag with something in it. All mm. right, that, that's intriguing. Yeah. I wonder if there's a checklist in here somewhere so I hope can so. see. Oh, gee, there's lots of stuff. How do I just pour it, it all out? It does say 15 plus pieces. Looks like we've got instructions. So we have instructions here, yes. Uh, let's see. Um... Uh, there's a, there's a boot. We'll build character. To build a character, place ball joint into socket, and then I assume just go from there. Aha. Uh -huh. Is there inside like the, the cardboard on the outside maybe like a checklist or anything? So we can see what our characters look like? No. Well, I've got a kiwi. Oh. oh. Okay. All right. So it looks like uh, no checklist, unfortunately. So we can't see... What sort of 36 well, there are, or if there's yours? any rares or anything? Oh, actually, how about I open up my mystery rubbish bags? Alright. So I assume this is bits of my robot, because they've got the little ball bearings sort of to plug in. Of, of your kiwi robot. Yeah, I like kiwis. Alright. And more trash. So, they, they, so the, the actual bots don't have too many pieces? No. Um, also, if you're familiar with hex bugs, normally they um, have a switch and they turn on, they kind of go zzz, 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 and like move. Um, these do not do that. They're just figures that happen to be part of the, the hex bug kind of realm, I guess. Alright, oh boy. This... Alright, well, mine's right on top. We can see found. Wait, did yours. Hang on, what did yours look like? Oh, wrong piece of paper. Where was yours? So you got Kiwi, I got found? Yep. Interesting. Uh, mine says not shellfish, snippy, cute, happy, cuddly kind. It responds to pinch. And then a phone number. What you the? Can call. <laughs> okay. My goodness. I better not get the pieces mixed up with yours. Now, hang on. I'm hanging on. Do they all have the same body? Oh. oh. I think, is this, um, I, I wasn't sure as well if maybe this was some sort of web series. Uh, I vaguely remember it being something. So let us know. Um, you can't comment here, but you can via one of the links to our other YouTube channels or social media. Uh, let us know if this is indeed a web series and why they both have the same base body. Oh. That's very interesting. This is tricky because there's no instructions. Yeah, I think, I think instructions might have been useful here. We might need, um, do you want to open up your, your garbage and we might sort of cut to when they're built because I'm having some trouble here. <laughs> Me too already. All right. Let's see what's in the garbage bag. I've got two. Did you have two? Uh, I did. Yes. Okay. We have... Oh, well, pieces are rolling away. Uh, some small bits that I'm sure help me put yes, found they, they, together. They're used for linking. Okay. And... Um, now, you can take these tags off kind of without ripping the bag, but I think it's just easier to kind of rip into it. But obviously, if you want to keep those as part of the look or, you know, to play with, be very careful to do that. All right, I've got some more bits. 
All right, we'll try and fit these together. <laughs> okay, so uh, it's uh, taken a while. Uh, yeah, so there's a problem when you have things you can build but don't really give any instructions. And there's a lot of little pieces that go in very different places where you wouldn't oh, necessarily um, put them. Also, some of them don't go together that well. And Laura almost broke when she was trying to push this arm and you can probably see there. Oh, this doesn't stay well, in. There you go, it's actually just broken off. Yeah, so you actually have to put quite a bit of force to putting these together. Um, like the ball joints do have to kind of pop in. And unfortunately, just the amount of pressure needed to push that one in broke it. Um, What's interesting... Yeah, oh. What's interesting is there's a little mechanism on top. If you put something in top, it spins like little turbine. Hmm. Um, yeah, so the only instructions you get are these. Uh, they're in black and white. It gives you a front and back, and it's quite difficult to determine sort of what piece goes where. Uh, yeah, so we've got some leftover pieces for found, the, the, the crab sort of one. Uh, he, crab's eyes are supposed to be these two ones that go on this little section here, but it doesn't actually clip in. It just sort of falls out so mm. yeah i mean look maybe with instructions they would go together a little bit better um without them uh, so I, I think mm -hmm. my kiwi is better than yours yeah i think yours is much cooler nathan ended up having to build both of them i i just could not get that to go um, together i'm positive this is not exactly how the manual sort of says it goes but also this foot just doesn't doesn't actually like screw on or stay on in any way. So the thing is, I mean, are they for display or are they for playing? If they're for playing, you'd think they would fall apart fairly regularly. Oh, I got it to stand. <gasps> oh. Uh, yeah, look, I, I, these are definitely not my favorite. Um, maybe we're missing something here. M maybe you meant to go online for instructions, but then that's hard if it's for kids. So, um, I think the best parts yeah. are the fake groceries, fluffy suds, laundry soap, uh, Papa Chow, my one, the, the Galacticos, That's says on the side, cool. they're out of this world. And my... Well, this says, it's chow for puppers. Crunchy Clump Cereal says, guess that clump. This one doesn't say anything. Um, also, you got your, your lovely toilet paper. Um, we also had some, a, a blue shoe. Maybe that goes on better than your wooden... I bit. think, they, they, these are my two theories. One... Uh, they're just extra pieces you can use to build your bot and customize it. Or two, the, they color code. So if you buy enough of them and you get the, all the individual like blue pieces, you can build another individual robot. But no, that doesn't that doesn't that doesn't go together any better, unfortunately. I think I'd prefer just to have the regular hex bugs that go. Yeah, which are totally different from these. Uh, if you enjoyed watching this video, give us a thumbs up. Uh, let us know if this was a web series and maybe if you've got some instructions off their website or something. If yours went together better, um, you can do that via any of the links to the other channels or social media below. Hit that subscribe button and uh, check back soon so you don't miss any new videos. We have them every single Friday. Sounds good. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.